Chicos, bueno, muy buenas tardes. <risa> buenas tardes, señores y señoras, damas y caballeros. Bienvenidos. There's a little echo. I don't know if it's just sí, the echo. ambience of the room. Or the hollowness yeah, of the room. Can't fix it, don't worry about it. I doubt it'll learn. It, it might also just be... Oh, es normal, that, no? that kind of fix. Yeah. It might also just be my voice being picked up on his headset too. Yeah. Yo, este güey. Sí. Y a mí también me oigo. Sí, te acostumbras, pero. No se vale. Haz el número 9. Let me know when you're good. Ready? Alright. Welcome to DLC happening at Nostalgia Comics. Thank you very much for hosting, guys. This is Super Smash Brothers Ultimate with RGB Brown from Texas. First up, we have Zion Music versus Rob, is his name. It looks like they're doing. Snake versus Falco, which is an interesting matchup. Um, Rob is a new face here, I haven't necessarily seen him at any of our tournaments before. Are you not going to change the layout, dude? <laughs> Are you not going to change the layout, dude? <laughs> so, so far, Zion is like, off to a good start. He's, at, um, he's already got the Snake at 1 to 8, 32%, nothing to really bone about. But. Oh, that's a good parry. Unfortunately, Snake has the second grab, so we can able to get much of a comfort off of that. Zion Music with the parry already. That's a cool transition. Zion Music with the parry. Um, hopefully, he's gonna be able to seal out the stock at about 140%. I see no reason why not to. Down smash, unfortunately, it's definitely in the wrong direction, but that S smash is definitely gonna seal the deal. Um, okay, Maniac going in here. I love my knees. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, I really think that the uh, snake, it's going to be a little difficult to try to get some sort of control with uh, the projectile that he has simply because of the reflectors. And Falco's movement, I mean, if he's throwing him anywhere on the floor, Falco jumps so high. He's the highest double jump in the game, so you know, he should be avoiding him. And the fast falls so hard, it's yeah, so absolutely. hard to chase So as soon as the, op the opportunity or the opening comes up or he has to land safely, he's basically just, I'm going to touch the floor now. Exactly. Right in his face. Um, so Zy Music, uh, pretty good lead here, but... And I think one one up tilt from the snake won't take. You, know? you think you killed him this percent? I think so. You know he's going up tilt, please. Alright, it's a little double coming up from Falco. The standard Falco things. Just Falco things, hashtag. Yeah, true that. Because I believe one of the better representatives of this character that we have here in the game. Let's see if it's real stack here. Okay. Looks like you got the South Club DS that's doing really low for that down there. Able to land. Good stuff coming up from Zy music. Punish the up, but you weren't really low, did for that down there. Yeah, um, and now he has a commanding lead here. Absolutely. Three stocks to one. At this point, you can essentially just be playing around with the stock. Yeah, pretty much. He's got a stock and a half, just building up extra credit, seeing if you can maybe seal out the stock this turn. Yeah, so it's a really bad position for the snake to be in, especially considering the down air that Falco has definitely beats the up even. Yeah. Oh, okay. Are you wild? <laughs> The Zypher, that's the name of the enemy, I can not Yeah. And has he even gotten touched since the first stop down? Oh. <laughs> I've seen him at 135 for a long yeah, time. He's really commanding. Okay, good up. So, getting right off the stage. Ooh, we tried to go for a pair and some sort okay. of fun. Dak Dak absolutely is going to seal it. Are we watching a comeback here? <laughs> is this Robert? Well, let's hope so. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, never mind. I thought that was the uptilt, but Give no. Give him a taste of the size 8 Tim's. Falco able to seal it out. I wonder what they're going to counterpick. Oh, okay. He's explaining the stages that are there. Uh -huh. Rob being one of the newer players. Once again, thank you very much for Salt for hosting DLC Comics. Yeah, really nice venue. It is. If you guys need any sort of vintage game needs, any sort of comic needs, stop by. It's here in Brownsville, Texas, located in Arkansas Way. Not too far from Boca Chica, Four Corners, if you know the locations. Yes, sir. I've been coming here for a long time. Do you remember coming to these tournaments on the Star Trek Yes. Oh, man. That was, that was really cool. Early Smash 4 days. Yeah. We really like <laughs> Smash 4, though. You know? Yeah, and now we're back for Ultimate. And that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just squeezed on by and said, hey, guys, remember us? And then we're going to leave right after you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It'll be fun. Okay, looks like they're sticking his guns. Are we switching up in Cloud? Okay. Uh, I guess he's hoping the, uh, the sword would give him a bit of an advantage here. Yeah, I could see that being a good pick. Um, but I let's see if uh, he doesn't get gimped by, you know, Falco in a tilt or something. 
No, absolutely. His recovery is going to be very limited here, but he doesn't have to worry too much about projectile damage. Uh, I mean, if he feels like he's being threatened down or anything like that, he has, you know, safer moves with the sword to really combat. And with the uh, the limit that he gets, it doesn't really matter how much he's going to target. He's already got it, and it's already been, what, 10, 20 seconds or something? Yeah. Nothing hard whatsoever, but okay, yeah. Wasting his limit to recover on this stage, he's playing it very wisely. Unfortunately, falling into that S match, he just did not have a response for coming in a blank He just tomahawk right in his face. Yeah, that was a good preemptive uh, S match to, you know, cover that landing. It sort of covers above him too, so like, even yeah. if he would have come off or something I actually like that. noticed that. I didn't know that, but then I got, I died for it, so uh -huh. now I know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, and since, uh, Falco, or oh, Falco, I'm sorry, Cloud's affair starts off from the top and swings to the bottom, there's that chance where you'll click in before he clicks you, you know? Yeah, exactly. Okay, I almost got him with the uh, F smash there. So I'm gonna take advantage of this weight. Oh, Klein has it coming in strong there. 103%, that's still a lot better. A little bit more of a lead than he had with Snake at the beginning. Uh, oh, oh okay. for that last hit. Good stuff. It was. 84% uh, though is a good amount of extra credit. Cloud has the limit. I was about to say he has to use it soon, otherwise it'll run out. So that's going to take full advantage of the end lag on that, especially if we can get back here. Laser, I thought so. He's going to walk off. Oh, there. That's absolutely going to get. That's a trade that you want with this yeah. character. The name of the game is it's a kill. It's to get them off the stage. Yeah, and against Cloud, there's no way you're not going to get to that. You know? No, absolutely not. You have to go down there. What, what's it going to up you? You know that move. <laughs> like, you've seen it thousands of times yeah. at this point, especially if you play Smash 4. Huh? Sure. And I think even with a limit up you, so we're still trading like that. Uh huh. No. That's true. Oh, unfortunate. unfortunate climb hander. Not able to make use of the wall to wall jump or assist his recovery in many ways, but uh, this stuff design means you're taking it 2 0 over Rob. Yeah. So.